If you are so inclined, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. On this very special episode of GET, I, George Washington, have come back from the dead. Here are the announcements for Thursday, October 31st, 2024. Harris or Trump, Holly or Koontz, yes or no on Amendment 3? You get to decide. Next Monday, November 4th, CHS will be hosting a mock general election. Students will be able to vote on a total of 10 races, including the presidency, reproductive rights, the minimum wage, and more. You can cast your ballot in the CHS library between 8 a.m. and 3 p.m. In order to participate, you will need a photo ID and to have registered earlier in the semester. Make sure to use your voice and vote. Registration for the Seal of Biliteracy is now open. Seniors who are proficient in English and at least one other language are encouraged to apply. All applicants must submit the Google form by November 8th. Questions? Ask your world languages teacher to or stop by room 137 to speak with Madame Kaspari. Boys swimming and diving had conference finals last night at Lindbergh. Chris Panzer started the evening with third place in diving, which electrified the team and set them on course to become the first conference championship team since 2016. Here are some other highlights. Mark Yerkins placed in the 200 IM and 100 breast. Tyler He placed in the 100 back and was fourth in the 100 free. Ryosuke Kobayashi placed in the 200 IM and was seventh in the 100 back. Aiden Brennan placed fifth in the 500 free and fourth in the 100 fly. Casey Chu placed third in the 100 back and the second in the 200 IM. Wing Su Yin placed second in the 100 fly and won the 200 IM. Aiden Kim won the 200 and 500 free. Austin Chu won the 50 free and the 100 FL with a new school record. Aiden Wangsu, Casey, and Austin won the 200 medley and the 400 free relays, both new school records. Congratulations to the whole team. The Greyhounds head to the state championships on November 15th and 16th. Wickenheiser Cup state champions return to the ice for the 24th through 25th season this weekend. Come cheer on the Varsity Greyhounds as they face Westminster on Saturday night at 10 p.m. at the Afton Ice Rink. Go Hounds! Playoff football returns home this Friday. Come out to Gay Field tomorrow at 7 p.m. to see the Brentwood Clayton Greyhounds take on Fort Zumal East Lions in the first round of district playoff action. All students are free with a student ID. <laughs> For GNN Productions, this is your former president, George Washington. Have a great day, Greyhounds.